What's up guys? So here I just have a little quick, really quick DIY on how to reset your service oil light. So when you first turn on your car, as you can see, I actually just reset mine just to double check that it works. But you can see it says inspection and it says how many miles I have until I need to get an oil change. So that is exactly, I just reset it so that's exactly how many you should have. I think it's uh, 15,525 miles until you need to get an oil change. That's what BMW sets it at. I do far, I do far less. I do around 10, but that's just a nice marker to tell me when I need to actually have my oil serviced in. So instead of having a sticker like most people have in the upper right hand corner of the actual car that's built into the car, many people don't know how to reset it. So in this video, I'm just gonna show you quickly how to reset it. So if you ever just do a DIY oil, oil change or if they just actually forget to change it wherever you go, I'll show you how to do it. It's very simple. All you need is your key and you have to have it in, um, in the ignition obviously and I'll show you what to do in a second. All right, to start doing this, I'm gonna walk you through it. I'm just gonna tell you what to do. You're gonna hold this button down for about five seconds. And then after five seconds, you're gonna put your key in, in the ignition and switch it to position one. To know if you're in position one, it's you put it in the ignition, you go one click, and it just says inspection with how many miles you have until your next oil change. And then that's position two with all the lights lit up. We don't want that, so I'm gonna shut it back off. So to do this, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold in the left button right between the gas and how and the miles per hour or kilometers per hour, depending on where you live. So you're gonna hold this button in for about five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. You're gonna put the key into position one, hold it, it's gonna say test. And then it's gonna say reset. Right now mine doesn't say reset because I just reset it. And then it's gonna blink, you're gonna let go, you're gonna press again. And the word end should pop up. It says end, you let go, and you're all set and then you can shut it off and to make sure to tell you that you actually reset it if you press actually if you put the key into the ignition position one position one it should say 15,525 miles to your next inspection that's good and after that you're all set thank you so much for watching it's a very quick and short diy on how to uh, reset your oil light after you just did your own oil change or wherever you got your oil wherever you got your oil change they forgot to but it's a really nice feature you no longer have to have a sticker in your in the top corner of your windshield looking disgusting you can just do this and it's very easy and you can do it at any times so i highly suggest doing this if you don't know where your car is at you can do it as a marker or if it's never been done but other than that um this is the end of the video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe